Hello and welcome back to the course. Let's finally start saving our time and let computer do the job. Goal of this lecture will be to demonstrate and quantify the benefit of using user form. Let's start by introducing our simple yet common scenario of data collection, decision taking and reporting. This scenario will be happening in the company that is specializing in purchasing gold old cars for then later resell them with a profit. Let's assume uh, we are a car dealer employee who need to assess the car using predefined checklist. Final goal will be to assess the car and write a report that will have a brief explanation of the found gaps. Company manager will later review and report and will make a final approval of purchase. By the way, consider this is just a fun demonstration case, as a uh, course is not really intended to teach you on purchasing second-hand cars. In the following demonstration, I will be assessing my good old Toyota car, pretending to be a dealer myself. I will obviously make not complete assessment, but only focus on several points. I have already made pictures and saved them to my computer, and now I need to generate report using my working document. So let us see how the company employer is using the original checklist. Obviously, I will fast forward the process, so you will then listen some music in the meanwhile. Perfect. And now you will be acting as a young and ambitious company employee. You decided to improve current process and so you added an Excel user form on top of the very same working template. To convince others, you decided to make a competition and measure the efficiency of the current process and proposed new way while using user form. You will use a software that will register mouse click distance that mouse travels, and the time it takes to complete the form. As you already noticed in the previous showcase, we have already registered these three metrics. And now let's see how the process will look like if we use the Excel user form.
It was fun and quick exercise. So we understood that by applying a user form, you can make work with Office documents approximately two times faster with much less mouse clicks and unnecessary movements. Let me consolidate this finding with general summary of why the user form was very good for this process. First of all, in helping to bring all information to one place and let person to concentrate on the task. The second advantage is that user form makes the entire process much faster because it's automated data flow process. I hope you have already an idea on where you can apply this tool. For this, feel free to participate in a quick reflection exercise in the next lecture. Obviously, feel free to post a comment into the discussion board of this course. In a future lecture, I would share with you all these templates and we will start building our understanding on how they work and how you can apply them to your particular situation.